And some civil society groups have called on the federal government to address the high-level insecurity in the country. The group who started their peaceful protest in Ikeja marched to the Lagos State House of Assembly, where they presented their demands. They called for a national day of action against insecurity and mass poverty that has plagued the nation recently. Some of the protesters who spoke to newsmen called on the federal government to be alive to its responsibility of protecting the lives and property of the citizens. There is a, yes, an upcoming anger. People can no longer take certain things. Nothing is guaranteed. Life, in fact, in, before, when we were younger, you understand, you hardly hear killing of police people. Today is a common, is a norm now. The Nigerian people have come to the realization that the future lies in their hands. They have decided to take their destiny into their hands. And in doing that, they are expressing their fundamental right to freely express themselves, demonstrate their anger, show their resentment, and tell the Nigerian leaders, or if you like rulers, that they are performing below expectation. No place is safe. For as long as we allow this thing unchecked, to go on unchecked, it will get to our doorsteps. And so we are trying to be proactive, to say enough is enough. We cannot allow the political actors who have disappointed us in this country continuously to keep on, give, to keep on giving, giving us false promises.